All right guys, real quick, Anthony and I are gonna do my three golf ball throws for this vlog. And we actually threw two off of camera. And look where they went, here. Mine was closer than that. Yeah, Anthony, I don't know why your ball rolled over there, but the they're over there. But we got super, super close, and now I decided to bust down my camera. We're gonna throw the three for the vlog. Imagine if we make them. We got that Jessica and Chanel. Crazy. I told them if I make this, one million likes. Like, that's never been done before on my YouTube channel, so. Has anyone ever hit one? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, ready? Yeah, go. Scoot over there. Okay, that has to at least go on the green. <gasps> oh, 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 oh! Please, please, please! Oh my so god! Cool. Damn, is that all your zooms in? Yeah, but what? That was so close! Oh my god! That was bad, that was bad. Yeah, it didn't even make it on the green. It's better to throw like a line drive rather than like a pop fly. You got this. Okay. No, that's not even going on the green. I don't yes, think. It is. Oh. Damn, I'm bad. Not worse than mine. Mine literally went in the that. grass. Wait, what did you guys just find? We found at least 25 golf balls. No at way. We won the ball. All in his pocket. We climbed. Like the we climbed behind the, the fence. That just like. 10 feet behind there. We Wait, that's someone. so weird because yesterday you found eight and I'm like, how can you find eight golf balls in our backyard? He just yeah, found just 20. How many he we found. Are you serious? I found a lot too. They just came around the corner and we were wondering where you guys went. Oh no God. way. And they're old. Some of them old, some of them, yeah. Dad, what? <laughs> it's like you're giving birth to golf balls. <laughs> no way. Dude, wait. Brian, no! Right? <gasps> no way! What? <laughs> These aren't even the ones that I buy, I don't think. Walk. Wait, we show me where, walk. show me where, okay. quick. Dad, no way you found all these. What? Four more? <laughs> Dude, I'm serious, we barely even walk. You no, guys are no, joking, Dad. Uh, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31. 31 golf balls in our backyard. <laughs> guys, me and Dennis were just chilling, and then Dennis is like, your dad and Anthony left for like 10 minutes. I don't know where they went. And then they come around the corner out of nowhere screaming, saying, you won't believe what we found. It's like you guys found treasure, basically. That's how you guys sounded. You thought we were going to say, like, a snake or something? We're like, yeah, oh, no, I thought you guys found a snake. We're literally right here. It's no way. in here, but behind the fence, we climbed this. They hit him from there, I think. Yeah, because there's a, there's a hole over there. But yeah. well, they're all behind this, just this area behind Me this and your dad, we climbed up that, then we went around here. Wait, I can't imagine how long they've been there. Because I'm sure the... Cause I'm sure the last homeowners didn't like bother checking over here. Some of them were broken. Look, literally right here. I'm sure you could even find one or two. No way! What? <laughs> Guys, look at this praying mantis on our couch. Oh my god, it's moving. Dad, are you gonna catch it right now? Yeah, you want it to the outside? Uh, sure. Unless you want to keep it as a pet. <laughs> Come on. Oh, 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 oh! I thought you were gonna just like. Oh wait, they fly. Dad, I thought you were gonna do this. Like, look, grab it. Like, <laughs> my legs. Uh oh. <gasps> Wait, did it bite you? Wait, Dad, 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 let me see. Look at that. Oh my God. Yes. Oh. Okay, go, go, go. Release him. Let's see if I can make it hole in one. Yes, Dad. The golf ball shots. Hole in one. Hey, you got it? Dad, did it really bite you? Yeah. Okay, what the actual fuck, guys? Like, I don't know what to say. I don't know how this happened. I don't know who's doing this, but basically the other day, Anthony and I tried a 24-hour overnight challenge at the Haunted Tunnel. If you guys saw that video, we found a baby doll at the front of the tunnel and we knew someone was messing with us. We were like, okay, people put that there to scare us. They knew we were gonna come do it. And um, this morning I woke up, I checked my Snapchat and my brother's girlfriend, Jackie, Snapchatted me. And I'm like, okay, whatever, what is it? Cause like she always leaves in the morning and I open it and she Snapchats my car and the baby doll that we found at the tunnel is on my car right now. And I know you guys are probably like, okay, you obviously put it there. You brought the doll, you did this. I swear this is not me doing this. Look at this, please. Please just look at the doll. That's the doll at the tunnel. I already went downstairs and looked at it. Guys, I put that on. I did not touch that doll. Anthony and I left it there. We're like, we're not touching it. We're not messing with it. But I do remember it has a phone number on the back. 
and I'm gonna bring it inside and call the number and this is so creepy because I was actually watching The Conjuring last night, which is a scary movie. And in the beginning, the doll follows them. And this is not okay, guys. Like, I don't understand what's going on. And this is the crazy part. My brother and Dennis went out to eat last night. And they came back around 1 and they said that the doll wasn't on my car at 1 a.m. So that means someone did this, like, later on throughout the night. I don't know who it is. We have no cameras at this house. That's the only bad thing. There's cameras at the front. This is a gated community, by the way. So, like, it's... Like, you can't get in. Like, that's the thing. Like, whoever's doing this has to be either, like, a friend of mine that's messing with me or someone that lives in this community or someone, like, hopped over the fence. I don't know what it could be. Guys, what time did you guys come home last night? We came home, like, 12.50 or, like, 12.45, and we didn't see anything on the car. And for anyone who says, oh, maybe you just didn't look that way, no, because Jackie, my girlfriend, had to move her car because yeah. it was in the way of my where I wanted to park. So we all stayed outside. We like You would have seen the doll, that's what obviously. I'm Jackie was moving her car. So we stayed outside for a while. So we were like looking around. We didn't see the doll. There's no way. So maybe if we just came out 1 a.m. and walked inside, maybe we didn't see it. But we had to stay out. Jackie was moving her car. He was like. I was standing right in front of his car. Yeah, by the way, was, I was asleep by like 12, yeah, 1230. There was, there was I was nothing asleep. on the car at least by 1 a.m. And I didn't think of the doll. After the tunnel, Anthony and I left it there. Yeah. And we're like, okay, we're not touching the doll. We're not messing with it. And it's on my car. What the so hell? At 1 a.m. there was nothing there. And then Jackie left this morning at 7 a.m. And she sent me a Snapchat of the doll. Yeah, me so, too. That's so, how I noticed it. Like yeah, between 1 to 7. What the f Okay, guys. Like I said, there's a number on the back of the doll. I was too scared to call it last time. But, I mean... If it's here, guys, I'm telling you, this has to be, like, one of the creepiest things that's ever happened. And I promise you, like, I hope you guys believe me when I say that I did not do any of this. This is not staged. Like, I didn't bring the doll to the tunnel to begin with. Like, we saw that there, and we just, like, assumed that there were people there messing with us. And we just left it there. Like, obviously, we weren't going to take it. And two days later, or is it three days? Like, it's been a while. Like, it's it's been three or four days, and now it's on my car. So... Someone had to have like seen the video, went back to the tunnel, or it could have been the same people. I'm just really confused, so I don't know, guys. I'm going to wait to call the number, but let me just show you guys the doll. This is the same exact one from the tunnel with the 666 and the black eyes hold me rug. Remember when we found this at the tunnel? What else does it say? I was his son. Wait, I didn't even read this because we didn't even like get a good look at the doll at the tunnel. It was dark and we were already scared. Oh no, the number's crossed out. Oh, I could still see it. I could still see it. Guys, I'm not going to show the number on the video, but they crossed out the number. Okay, they made my they made my car a mess. Another thing is, guys, like, you can't come onto my property no matter if you're trying to scare me, like, trying to, like, get in my video and stuff. You can't come onto my property, especially this is a gated community. Like, you can't just climb over the fence. Like, I don't know how the hell you guys got in here, whoever it is, but the number's crossed out, but I could still see it. So I'm still going to try to call the number. It's kind of hard to read. Oh my God, there's ants crawling all on me now, but this is sketch. Just saying you cannot come onto my property even if it's just to scare me and like try to get in my video. You can't do that because like I have the right to call the cops and I have a phone number here. Like come on guys, don't do that. And you made my car dirty but that's like the least of my concerns now. I need to get to the bottom of this. I don't know who did this. I don't know how the hell they got in our community but we're going to call the number. That's so freaky guys. I can't really read it that well but I'm going to try. I'm going to try okay. Why would they cross out the number? There's no way they're going to answer. So this is a valid number. I'm scared. I'm low-key shaking. Like, I'm scared to, like, see if they answer. All right. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. James. Is not available. Okay. That is weird, okay? His name is James. Look at the crossed out name. It says James. So I got the right number. He just didn't answer. That's so weird. All right, guys, it's been about like an hour since I called that number and I want to give it another shot right now. I want to get to the bottom of this. Like, what the heck? I just looked. The area code is a New York number. Unless the people who put that doll there like put a random number. I know his name's James, okay? Huh? Hello? Huh? Hey. Who is this? Um, this is Brian. Who's this? Oh, this is James. Oh, hi, James. Hi. Uh, <laughs> do you know who I am? Yeah. Do you know who yeah, I am? Yeah, this is Faze Rug. Yeah, that's me. Oh, hey. Oh, what's up? <laughs> so you found the 
found the doll. I did find the doll. What? What's the meaning behind that? What? I don't understand. Well, we went to my. Well, we were in San Diego and we just put the doll in there as a joke. Oh my god. <laughs> and I, I just kind of wanted to see what your reaction would be. That's so funny. Did you see it in the video? Yeah, I did. Okay. I didn't. I didn't know how long it would be until you posted, so I put the doll in there. I see you post. I'm like, oh my gosh, is this? Wait, but this is the crazy part. Um, this morning I woke up and the doll was on my car. Are you serious? You didn't do that? No, I didn't. No, we left yesterday. Oh, wait, you live in New York? Yeah, I do. Oh, okay. <laughs> wait, people were thinking like that I put the doll there just for like entertainment. Yeah, I, know. I know, and I posted on your, your like, Comments? I posted on your video, like, I put the doll in there. That's so crazy, oh my god. No, but now I'm just wondering because, um, I woke up this morning and the doll was on the hood of my car, and I'm like, okay, what is this? And then I, I checked the back of the doll and your phone number is crossed out, but I could still see it. So I decided to give you a call. Okay, thank you. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Um, yeah, thanks for scaring the shit out of me and Anthony at the tunnel. <laughs> okay, so the person who put the doll in the tunnel is someone who lives in New York that came to visit San Diego and he wanted to scare me and Anthony. And he did that, okay? He scared us. But now I'm wondering how the hell the doll got on my car. And I promise you guys, like, I would never lie to you guys. And I always keep it real with you guys. We did not take the doll from the tunnel. Like, we didn't touch it. We didn't pick it up. We didn't take it in my car, I never took it to my house, like we left it there. So that's why I'm so concerned as to how the hell it got on my car. You heard my brother and Dennis, they came home at one, it wasn't there, I was asleep. I had gotten food last night around 11 p.m. in my car and I came home, parked it, they came home at one, I was asleep so it had to be from like one to seven because Jackie left at seven so it really makes no sense. I'm gonna try to get to the bottom of it somehow. I tried calling the security at the front to see if he can like go through the footage overnight to see if someone like hopped over the fence. He said he's gonna look it over and then give me a call if he sees something. So I'm waiting for that call back to see if he saw someone like hop the fence or anything. But you cannot do that by the way. Like for you being on my property, I can call the cops and you could easily get arrested. So um, just don't ever try that again, whoever's doing this. Unless somehow miraculously the doll just ended up on my car overnight. It just, just followed me from the tunnel. I don't know. Okay guys, I need some help. I want you guys to tell me which camera quality you like better. Do you like this one, what I've been recording with for like the past two weeks, three weeks? I think even like two months maybe. I don't know. I've had this camera, it's the Sony, okay? Now I'm gonna switch the cameras right now and tell me if you like that quality more or this one. Ready? <sighs> Okay, this is the Canon G7X quality, so let me know which one you guys like more, this one or the other one, and depending on what you guys like more, I'm gonna use that camera, obviously, because quality is important in a video, and whichever one you guys like more, I'm gonna use, so let me know. But for now, I'm gonna go back to the other camera to finish off this video, and then based off of what you guys say, starting from tomorrow's video, we're gonna use that camera that you guys like. We're back. <laughs> mom, 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 mom. You know, I weighed and weighed and weighed. <laughs> the time happened. I'm not paying attention. <laughs> okay, guys, I, right when my mom woke up, I told her about the doll. Isn't that weird? Yeah. Like, I called the guy on the phone, and he answered, and it was just like a fan. He's like, oh, I want to scare you and Anthony. Oh. But I'll never understand how it got on my car, because me and Anthony, mom, I swear, she even thought that I put the doll in the car. Yeah. That's we didn't take stupid. it from the tunnel, so, like, I'm still trying to get to the bottom of that, but, mom, right now, I'm going to head to the store. I'll Where? see you soon. And guys, Bosley's sitting right here for those wondering. The pool cleaner is here. And if you guys don't remember, Bosley hates the pool cleaner for some reason. Was gonna hide in my <laughs> Bosley, you were gonna fight the pool cleaner? Alright, if you guys are wondering why I'm going to the sports store right now, I'm actually gonna be buying golf clubs. And I'm gonna be golfing from my backyard to the golf course. And I've never golfed before. Like I said, I've only been miniature golfing. I've only gone miniature golfing my whole life. I've never like held a real golf club. And since we basically live on a golf course, um, I promised this video a long time ago and I think I'm gonna do it right now. I'm gonna be golfing from my backyard and seeing if I can make it in the hole. I don't think that's gonna work. I mean, I do the thing where I throw three golf balls per vlog. So I'm like, why not try actually golfing from my backyard? Okay, Brian, come on out. But I look silly. It's all right. I've seen you before. Woo! <laughs> you yeah, look silly. You guys, oh my god, I went all out at the sporting store. Like, I literally bought a golf club. I bought gloves, but it only came with one. I got home and I 
but it only came with one glove. You really look good. Thanks, but this is a party foul right here, guys. Nike socks with Yeezys. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just too lazy to change my socks, but um, I have never golfed before, like I said, but I also bought this. Follow me, mother. Mm -hmm. But yeah, you know, call me Tiger Rug. So in order to golf from my backyard, I bought this like turf mat to where you can put the golf ball in like a little pin and actually swing because like we don't have, we can't do it from the concrete. You can't just put the golf ball on the floor. So I bought this little turf mat and we can put like the little, the little tee where you put the ball and I'm gonna swing to the golf course. But obviously I'm gonna make sure no one's golfing on that hole or like um, make sure that everything is safe, of course. But um, a lot of you guys have requested this video of me golfing in my backyard, from my backyard to the golf course. So hope you guys do enjoy and we're gonna set this up. But watch me hit a hole in one. That would be impossible. Uh, I think that's impossible, but. Never, nothing impossible. Anything is possible, as long as you put your mind to it. So I'm gonna put in my mind that I can get a hole in one. Let's get it. <laughs> All right, guys, I got everything set up. This is like the little turf. You put the ball on this tee, and we just start hitting them from up here. But there's golfers right now. I don't think I'm gonna swing right now because um, I don't want to kill anyone. So I'm gonna wait till that hole clears up and make sure everything is good. I'm gonna be using these balls right here. My dad found 30 golf balls in our backyard. So I don't even think I have to buy any more from the store. I think I could literally just like go down here and find so many, along with a snake probably. All right guys, um, we're recording from my iPhone right now because you could zoom in better from my iPhone than my actual camera. And I think the quality should be fine. But um, this is gonna be my first attempt right here. Don't judge me on my form or like how I hit it because I have no idea how it's done, but we're gonna attempt it. What if I get a hole in one, mom? That would be insane. Cool. Okay, here we go. Let's do it. I think I need more room here though. Like, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Where did it go? It didn't even go on the golf course. <laughs> Alright, you know what? I have to at least make one on the green. That's one thing. I have to make one on the green. This is me practicing. Alright, here we go. Okay, okay, here we go. Oh my god, that went way too far. Wait. That went way too far. It went all the way over there, like over that hill. No way. That went way too far. What if I make it in another hole and I don't even like realize? Oh my god, that was crazy. I literally saw it like fly. All right, here we go. That's gonna go on the green, I think. Oh, it's on the green, it's on the green. Oh, it's rolling. All the way over there, right there. I don't know if you guys could see it. That actually landed on the green, damn it, that's fun. Ooh. That's on the green, that's on the green. Oh, oh, come on. Guys, I can't hit it with full force because if I hit it too hard, like the first attempt, it went way too far. Oh, nope, that's too short, too short. That's going on the green. Oh, no, it didn't go on the green. I have to hit it a little harder than that. Oh, that's going on the green. Oh, that's too hard. Oh, do you see that? That went way too far. Yeah. That's... It rolled all the way over there. Damn it. All right, guys, now we have oh, to go over here, the plants. Yeah. Hold on. So it is better, because like it's on flat surface. Oh, it chipped the plants. Oh, that's good. That's gonna land on the green. Oh, oh, come on, please. There has to be another hole there. Oh! <laughs> Guys, I know my form is extremely bad. It's just that if I use my whole like force like this, it's gonna go way too far. So I have to kind of hit it lightly, but not as light, you know? So here, let me show you guys. Oh, that's going on the green. That looks so accurate. Oh my God. Oh my god, it just passed the flag. Did you see that? Yes. Dude, it literally like it's skinned the flag. The That's going on the green. That's going on the green. Oh, it just goes too hard. Ooh, look, that one landed on those. In those plants. Is there a uh, I mean, yeah, hole the in there? No, I wish. All right, we're switching over to the yellow lucky balls right here. <laughs> and why they yellow are lucky? They were the most expensive. <laughs> nope. Wait, that's going on the green. Oh. It went all the way there. Damn, Again. I hit so many over there. 
Oh, it landed. Ooh. But like, I feel like it's it's gonna like hop over the thing, the hole. Okay, guys. That was me attempting to golf from my backyard. If you guys want to see more videos like this, please let me know. And the day that I make a hole in one is the day where you guys have to break 1 million likes on my video. I, like I said, I don't think that's possible, but who knows. Hey guys, subscribe if you are new to join the Rugrat Army. I love you all so much. Super close to 6 mil, less than 200k away. And other than that, it's been Rug, and I'm out. Peace.